Tatiana Arrington, where is the Buzz TV? Melissa, Jessica, how are you guys doing today? Good. How about you? I'm doing good. Jessica, what about you? Yeah, I'm. Uh, this has been really fun. It's my first press junket, so living, living the dream. <laughs> well, you guys look beautiful. Um, Excuse me. <laughs> so do you. Come on, come on with the shirt, please. <laughs> Please. You guys look great. Um, so I was able to watch the first three episodes uh, and already we're kind of on this really, really big, exciting journey. Uh, what did you guys think when you first got that initial script? Did you guys read the books at all or what were you excited about or hopeful about? So I read the script before I read the book because I was sent the script with my audition and I didn't read the book until I booked the part because I didn't want to like jinx myself or like love the story and then end up not getting the part and just like break my right. own heart but I read the script and just from the script like I was excited to know where the story was gonna go and like it's it's a brilliant script and like the rest of the season is incredible as well so I mean yeah just reading it I was really drawn to it and I couldn't I couldn't put it down yeah what about you Jessica yeah, I mean, I'm right there with Melissa. I think this story is just inherently exciting. The mystery is really well crafted, um, both what Karen McManus did with the book and then what Dario and uh, Erica did with the with the script and all the rest of the writers. So I think, um, yeah, I was really attracted to just the twists and turns of it all and the suspense and yeah. Yeah, so have you guys been able to make it to the end yet to know kind of what's happening? Or are you guys still kind of guessing along with the rest of us? <laughs> oh, so we were sent, we got the whole season, like all uh, seven okay. Okay. before we even started shooting. So like, we know, we know where, it was, where it's going to go. Gotcha. Okay. Okay. But I will, I will say we mm -hmm. just um, last week finished the finale episode. Oh, so, wow. Very fresh. Very fresh. Okay. Yeah. What can you tell us about your characters from where they kind of start in the beginning of this journey to maybe the end? Not really giving too much away, but kind of, okay, take us to like where they start off when we meet them. Um, for Maeve specifically, I think given her circumstances and like what she's been through like she went through like a battle with childhood leukemia so early in her mm -hmm. life that I think that like, directly shaped the way she is and like for her life could end at any second is how she kind of sees it so she's not going to be anything but like brutally honest and completely herself with people like so, that she is <laughs> I think I think she starts off at at a place of like already kind of like being herself but by the end of the season she somehow has come into her own that much more so I would yeah. say that's, that's where it starts and ends okay that's good to know what about you Jessica I mean Janae starts uh at the lowest point you can be at I think she's just lost the only person in her life so she starts pretty, pretty down. And um, I think what's fun about the show is that there's so many unexpected connections and so many unexpected friendships. And so Janae definitely connects with people that she never thought that she would. Yeah, absolutely. I, I could even see that in the first three episodes as well, that like she was already starting to come out of her shell a little bit and form relationships. Uh, did you, were you guys aware of how big of a fan base that the books actually had that people are so pumped up for the series to come out? I mean, I knew that it was like charting on the New York Times for like a ton of weeks when <laughs> I was researching the, the book to like mm -hmm. kind of familiarize myself with it. But yeah. I think, I think I can speak for all of us when I say, um, we were all shocked at how much of like a, a big thing it is mm -hmm. when there was like multiple fan pages made for us <laughs> while we were shooting the pilot. Because right. we hadn't seen a single frame of the show and there was already like a good handful of fan accounts. So I was like, okay, this, this, is, this is something major to people. Yeah.
uh, what do you guys hope fans get out of this? Because I feel like uh, people who may not be familiar may associate it with some of the other teen dramas or thrillers that are on TV right now. But what would you guys say makes this one so special and so different? I think um, Daddy O, the, the showrunner, put it really well. Uh, he said, you know, it's obviously full of, full of drama, full of suspense, full of romance, mm-hmm. all the things we want, all the things we want right. in a little teen show. But I think it's ultimately a little bit more wholesome and a little bit more feel good than say um, some of the darker, other dark teen shows out there. Right. Um, it's because it's ultimately about friendship. It's about these, the baby you four and the other characters coming together and connecting over this horrific thing that's happened and supporting each other and coming into their own. And I think, I, I, I honestly hope that um, audiences leave feeling like a little bit more seen and a little bit comforted. That would be cool. 100% because I noticed that even with all of the characters they're all kind of different and special in their own way but just enough to maybe be like oh I see myself in this person or oh I see myself in this person do you guys feel like you relate the most to your characters or another character Ooh. Mm. <laughs> I feel I don't know I feel like I guess Maeve the most just because like I did step into her shoes for the longest so it kind of just right. like meshes the most mm-hmm. but just watching the show like I really I connect with every single one like I feel like I'm such a mix of all of yeah. them there's a there's something about all of them that I can really relate and connect with mm-hmm. yeah that's a good yeah. one that's I would agree good. I would agree with that I think I'm probably a mix between Janae and Bronwyn Okay, I can see that. <laughs> That's cool. All right. Well, thank you guys so much for your time, ladies, and congrats on the show. The first three episodes were awesome, so I cannot wait to see the rest. Thank you, thank you so much. Thank you. Where is the buzz? Oh, yeah. Where is the buzz? You said we used to be a single. Oh, 